Hello everybody, we are coming into Knott's Berry Farm. We are coming into one of the last days of the Taste of Knott's events here at Knott's Berry Farm. Before their grand opening, things are definitely opening up. We've been driving down um, Winter Park Boulevard here and Beach Boulevard and things are definitely hopping. Things are definitely busy here. Like other um, tasting events here at Knott's. Now we're parking in the regular parking. Before we've always got to park in the three hour parking lot, but there was a guy over there that said that we couldn't park there. So we have to park in the regular parking. So that's different. Not very far though. There's not too many people, but it's just interesting how it we are goes. here and they still have lines at the marketplace. They're spacing out entries. And in the middle, they still have the picnic benches, but there's not so many people out there. Because in the restaurants, you can't eat inside now. And we're going to go. Looks like you can walk between the different places, too, if you wanted to. And it wouldn't, but they still have an entrance and an exit only. Denise is going to see. Nope, it's still closed. Okay. The hidden potty is still closed. So, there you go. The display window's up for taste of... The Boysenberry Festival with Boysenberry hand sanitizer. Totally. Why not? Boysenberry all the way. And you have the original. This guy right here, he was part of the original diorama for the Knott's history. And there's the original Ghost Town book. It used to be in the museum. Now you gotta go head through security. Yeah, and probably she's gonna wanna look through my back. Okay, yeah. we are in now. And we got our official tasting card here. And we're off to do a treasure hunt too, apparently. There's a virtual treasure hunt that you scan in for a pen. So that's kind of cool. And we're gonna just go see what we can find. Easter egg clue said that we have to go and find the ghost town jail. So that's what we're doing. Uh -huh. We know where the ghost town jail is we behind do. the sheriff's office so yeah right there looks like they have lots of vendors up lots of picnic tables out uh -huh. um ghost town grill is open yeah. so there's all sorts of stuff going on right now yeah. for the next easter egg we got to go and visit the catawampus the legendary catawampus oh and there's the baby cat i was gonna say is the baby cat is gone nope there's the baby catawampus <laughs> Species like extinct. The farmhouse is closed, but we can go forward behind the firehouse. We're going over to the toy maker, which I believe the toy maker is over this way. So we'll go over here next to the cemetery, and I believe the toys should be over here. So let's see if we can find that Easter egg. Huh. Do you see the Easter egg, Denise? I don't see it. This is the toy shop. Here at the toy story. The toy shop, and it says that we have to unscramble the eggs. I know where it goes. Do you know where it goes, Denise? Um. I think I figured it out. Uh, well, there's. We're not going to AMC OOPC, you no. Know. No, oh, Snoopy. What's the Undertaker's office is doing? How's he doing in there? Um. Still looking dead to me. A little bit of purple, but still dead. School is out. It's a Saturday, so that's a good thing. The woodworker has been carving. Lots of cool woodworking. What's this one with all the holes on it? What do you think that is? Oh, it's a moon. Yep. It's a cratered moon face. That's what that is. A moon bench and a cool eagle. Okay, here's the wilderness hall. I think we're supposed to go this way. The way it works for these is you have to go and you have to scan in your order. Okay, we got our noodles now. They look great. But now we got to go on the great picnic table hunt. So, you have tasted it. For my specifications, I would have preferred that there was like chicken instead of broccoli in there. But what do you think about it? Oh, the, the lack of chicken doesn't bother me. I, I like the noodles just as they are with the chunky vegetables. It's the top of my spiciness level. I, I can eat it, but I'm definitely slow eating it, which to me is actually probably a plus, you know. Uh -huh. What do you think about the noodles down? themselves? And then the noodles are a little mushy. 
So on a true like zero to five scale, I'd rate it three and a half out of five, where three and a half is still good, not where three and a half is like 60% and you're failing. No, no, no. But a three out of five is a solid, solid good. Okay. Thank you for your help though. Hello. Okay. <laughs> Are you having a nice time? We are. Good. I'm so glad. I love the, the back. Oh, back the beagle. Yeah, I back the that. beagle. That's so great. A great shark. Thank you guys for your help. I appreciate it. Thank you. Bye-bye. We are here at the entrance of Camp Snoopy. And I am officially looking for the next clue for our Camp Snoopy adventure. There's a bunny rabbit. I haven't seen anything yet. Interesting over here found any little kids on a train or anything. It's really empty out here. I don't think I've ever seen Camp Snoopy so empty before. But you really can appreciate all the flowers and stuff out here, so that's pretty cool. Okay, according to the guy, he said, over here, if we look for Charlie Brown fishing, we should be able to find that QR code thing. So let's see if we can find the QR code. Oh, there it is. And there is Charlie Brown fishing for Easter eggs. In the carrot garden over here. And it is very colorful, Denise. It is indeed. All the carrots are growing. Pretty hopping. You get it? Hopping, uh -huh. hopping, uh -huh. ha ha ha. And there's the scariest ride ever. The knots. The knots. I hate it all in that, for sure. The knots Ferris wheel. Yeah, that's the scariest of all. I wonder if the chocolate bunny's hollow. You think the chocolate bunny's hollow? We should get a selfie over with the chocolate bunny. Probably. Okay. Got, and it says we got. Um, I'm going something with a V in it. L T a G an A and S. I E. Uh, I don't know. A store with a V in it. A store with a V in it. Yeah. And. It's, the clue did say something about some blue doors and umbrella, but yeah, I don't know where that's gonna be. I'm gonna have to think for a second. Not so sure where this is. We figured it out. It says Fiesta Village. So we are on our way again. That took a little bit of more coordination. The other one was easy. I could get a Alam Camp Koopy, but I didn't get a Fiesta. <laughs> And there's a mushroom. I hope it's not a magic mushroom. He looks pretty happy. A little bit too happy eating that mushroom. He, he needs to watch it. I don't think those are legal yet in California. We got some more happy mushrooms over there. That's, I think I'm starting to get psychedelic here. Look at that one. It's like curved. It looks like a Smurf. Now I know why the Smurfs get their hats. Uh-huh. Yep. That must be Smurfettes. Okay. Now here in Fiesta Village and there's a disco going and I think over here by these blue doors and umbrella I should be able to find the next clue so Denise is gonna go look for french fries and I'm gonna go look for a clue. Denise what did you get? This they have a special clue today and they have the always so this is the classic that's always available Philly cheese fries with a boysenberry chutney. Okay gotta try it out and see if it's good. Is it good? Mm, well, the cheese part is good. Let me try one. Let's see. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. Pretty smooth. Mm -hmm. I like it. That's good. Mm -hmm. And I got the last clue, so we're so going So we are out. here on the boardwalk looking for our next clue. And it's pretty hopping out here. All the boardwalk games are open, so... Our clue said something about the cool cats. Don't know if that's the radio or if we're looking for actual cats, but... We're on the lookout for that egg again. I guess it's gonna be in the back. This is different over here. They got like ninja style game over here. Hang time. I don't think I would do very well in this game. Boys and bury everything. I'd definitely be out on that game. We're at the radio show here, so the radio show is got the bunny hop. You know how to do the bunny hop, Denise? Yeah. Thank you. We are over here by the Berry Factory, the Berry Tales Factory, which is the site for the new ride that's coming up as soon as they open in the summertime. This will be the new greatest and latest line. So we're out here 
to look for the next greatest and latest um, clue. So hopefully we find the clue out here somewhere. My guess would be over here by the car, but I don't know. That's what we're looking for. There's only gonna be five clues in these. I think there's been more than five clues. So we found this one by the car. Uh-huh. How are you doing so far? Oh, I'm having fun. This okay. is fun. I love it. Okay. Nice tour of the park. It's perfect. Okay, we'll keep on going then, I guess. It's Deniski approved. Totally. We Denise did it. Approved. And now we gotta go see the Easter Bunny for our, the last whatever. So let's go find the Easter Bunny Bunny up at the theater. So just for the Boysenberry Festival, because they're doing social distancing, you can walk on the electric flooring. This is the only time you can do this. So I had to come out and walk on the flooring. I don't even see a place to sit. But I just wanted to be able to say that I walked here over... Actually, there's a table over there that we could use. I just wanted to be able to say that we were able to walk on here. But pizza place. Wheeler Pizza, it's missing its sign, by the way, which is interesting, but it's pretty popular. Yeah, I expect a newly themed sign. So okay. You know? Okay, we made it up the ramp. And there's the bunny. And apparently we have to scan something else. We're definitely in a stroller line here. Here you can see this sign on the berry factory. It's cool and not very fine. And the Salt Theater had new LED sign. It's a new LED sign, which is kind of cool. Um, and we have a socially distanced bunny here. What's going on? Denise, my Zoom captured the scan. Perfect. Uh, no bunny for me. Yeah, yeah. Not gonna get me on this bunny. I just want the pin. Yeah. Give me my little half cent. The little kid can... Buy 2,000 yeah. of them for 20 bucks pin. Exactly. What I, I want. <laughs> Exciting rewards, Denise. Oh, it's a major award. Really? It's a major award. How cool is that? Woo! Happy Easter. We got a bunny pin. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we found all the clues. And, we and we're pretty much back to where we started because this is where we first ate. So, perfect. We're right back right. where we started from. Now we yeah. need to go to the big stage because it's almost four o'clock. Okay. okay, we got some video entertainment going on over here at the picnic tables. I don't know if they're gonna be performing here or in the wagon wheel, but we'll find out. So I think they're over at the wagon wheel, but we're at we'll sit here for a second. Okay. Yeah, Trump. How are they? Well, I don't know. You can try them. How do we know? First taste is yummy. Okay, what about the cookie? Mm. Bite the cookie. The good? Mm-hmm. Boysenberry cookie? Nice. I love the, um, the touch of nose ice cream going on. Yes. Okay, yummy. And it looks like we have a DJ up on the stage right now. We are here at the big stage and they have Crazy Kirk and the Hillbillies. And I see Anders up there and Rick and I don't know who the other guy is. So we're gonna check them out. Okay, she's back, and what she has, she brought? 
What did I bring? Yes. Oh, wait. tater tots topped with brisket and a boysenberry sauce. Okay, let's check it out. Well, taste it out, I should say. <laughs> we are now trying the churro bites. The churro bites come with like, I think it's white chocolate and berry mixed. Mm -hmm. Is it good? And it looks like sugar, just regular sugar, not cinnamon mm -hmm. sugar. Try it out here. This is okay. It's overall okay. Yeah. I'm not like the best about it. No, um, churros are slightly. They're slightly stale, actually. Stale, yeah. They were baked. This is a two out of five. Denise for her last one or second no, last one? No, second to the last one. one is getting key lime poison berry pie, is what she's getting. Let's see, how does it taste? Good. Nice and tarty. Yeah. Good. Mm -hmm. We are over by the Calico Saloon. And we got uh, some of the citizens of Calico out right now. Mackenzie? Somebody Mackenzie? with a Miss fan Mackenzie, and an. It's a pleasure to have you in town as well, my dear. And That's gorgeous seeing you both. You're both having a good time. Do you think you can show me your person? Oh, it's a judge. It's a boysenberry judge. I asked her. Yes, maybe on the That was gorgeous. Can you do check out some of the arts and crafts stuff here? Yeah. Hats and parasols. Bows. Yep, lots of bows. Denise likes bows. Hello. Do we have any questions? Well, I think that's going to do it for us today here at the Not Taste of Boysenberry Festival. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like it and subscribe to it. Or just leave peacefully. That'll work too. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll see you on the next video.